Early voting has begun here in Knox County. As voters show up to the polls, things will be just a little bit different. For the past few years, early voting has taken place in the courthouse, on the courthouse lawn, and finally at the Old County Jail Sallyport. Those changes were all due to the pandemic. But no matter the location, the voting location always included Kathy Roberts. This is something that I can do towards the political process. And I'm very interested in politics, which I know sounds crazy these days, <laughs> but I am. And I just feel like I'm doing my part. Robert's part has been to help voters handle those moves. Now it'll be to help them deal with an entirely new system. Well, the, the main change is uh, you'll be able to vote at any one location once, okay? Uh, you have to have e-poll books, which are basically iPads that has the voter registration information downloaded into them. So far, around 500 people have used the new e-poll books for early voting in downtown Vincennes. Additionally, 11 have voted in Bicknell and 15 in Monroe City. Both polls were open last Saturday morning. A little on the low side. I'm concerned that voter apathy is coming back with a vengeance, but I'm also optimistic, you know, last Saturday's the first day we had 80 degree weather. Early voting is giving poll workers a chance to get used to the new e-poll books before the primary. So far, Robert says the change has gone well. It's wonderful. It, everyone loves the new system. We love it as employees. It's a lot easier, less chance of, you know, something going wrong. It's been excellent. 